just a little update video. I just came back from my jiu-jitsu jiu -jitsu training. It's 1.30 a.m. Everybody's asleep. The whole world is asleep. And just wanted to say real quick that I want to think about what I'm going to say here. But, you know, first of all, what do I want to talk about here? I don't know. Just finished training jujitsu, tired. Just finished eating. And I'm thinking to myself, how can I make my YouTube channel a success? That's all I'm thinking about now. How do I make it a success? That's one of the questions I'm asking myself now. Even though I'm not really consumed by it, it's just, I ask myself this question a lot. Sometimes I forget about it and I don't think about it because, because it's immaterial. Well, it's not immaterial. It's important because I need to make money to survive and to live, right? Which is the most important thing in the world is money. Yeah, I mean, from my perspective, that's the most important thing in the world. I read this book, uh, The 48 Laws of Power, and it says in the book, you shouldn't chase the money. You should chase the power, and then the money will come. That's one of the most powerful things I ever read, but I'm also like, okay, power and money, do they go hand in hand? Okay, for example, Khabib, he was nothing in Dagestan. Nobody knew him. But then when he became the UFC champion, he became famous. And then the money and the fame and all of that comes with it. So to be known and to be famous, you either have to become the best at something in the entire world, and then you'll be famous... Or you can become some you can become really good at something and then you can become famous and get money. So the key here is to work hard and to get better at stuff. That's how you become more successful. How do I do that? It's like motivation is fleeting for me. You know, sometimes I have the motivation to make videos and then sometimes I don't. Sometimes I do them, sometimes I don't. Maybe I should make this a full-time thing and go all in. But then I'm like, I'm neglecting everything else. It's tough, man. Maybe I should gamble and try and succeed on this YouTube channel and maybe make something of it. It's not looking very likely. Maybe I could learn and watch a few more tutorials on YouTube to kind of grasp the concept of how I can succeed on YouTube and make more money and become more successful. I mean, it's it's a miracle that I've come this far with the with the with the amount that I have, right? It's a miracle. It's really a miracle. That I even came this far is a miracle already. So I guess I should be happy with the little that I have. But then I stop and think about it. I'm like, but this is nothing. It's not enough anymore. It's always a negative feedback loop constantly, like just reinforcing my own ideas and stuff. So then you stay in the same habit of thinking, you stay in the same habit of doing, and you just stay the same. You're never going to change. But if you do different things, and you learn new things, and new skills, you'll change, and you'll get better. But is change the best thing for you to do? Is that really the most important thing that you need to do? Change? It's not always necessary. But that's... But, but no, that's actually change. If you do what you've been doing, but then you do it with more intensity, with more 
effort, with more focus, that's change because you've changed the variables. So that's change. But then one could argue also it's just doing the same thing, but just with more intensity. And but then you've changed it because you've changed the variable. But besides the point, um, I'm get, I'm gonna get ready to sleep soon because I'm fucking tired. Gotta wake up tomorrow, make some videos, think about making videos, study for something, exam, stupid database exam coming up on the fifteenth of when? Fifteenth of this month or seventeen or sixteen? I don't know. But yeah, man, I've just been grappling with these thoughts, and this is just a little update for my subscribers out there. For any of you guys that want to know how I'm doing, uh, I'm doing okay. Like I've been doing a lot. I'm doing a lot better now than I've been doing before. Uh, the the jujitsu definitely helped um, give my mind a better perspective and maybe try and like humble me a little bit and look at things realistically and not be delusional and thinking that everything's gonna happen in one moment. Yeah, it takes time, patience, effort, focus, consistency. Those are the main things that you need to become successful. But then I think about all of the disadvantages that I have. Like, like I have... I'm at such a big disadvantage because other people, they have people to rely on. They have generational wealth. They have... Parents that actually love them. They have a family. They have siblings that give a fuck about them. And respect them and love them. But then I don't have any of those things. So it's like, I'm at such a big disadvantage. Because I have nothing. And then the other part is like, I have to work a thousand times harder to get to the same position that they've gone. Because they have more, they have a big leg up. They have a huge advantage. More money, more resources, more people to work together with because two minds are better than one. Um, I'm realistic, you know? I have to work 10, 20.